Ravel, 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 NP dot Ravel. Basically comparable to a rave at a crazy party. But this is a NumPy function that is quite useful because it unravels what you have. Why didn't they call it unravel? NP dot Ravel is of course a function of NumPy. So here I have a matrix A that I created before and what we're going to do is type in np.ravel of the matrix A. And you can see that it created a flattened array where it went one row at a time. So you see the negative two, two, one, and two was stuck in first. But if we do np.ravel of A with the keyword of F, you'll see that it does the same thing but columns first. So negative two, zero, one, two goes in first, followed by two, one, one, zero, and so on. So let me type np.ravel with a question mark so we can pull up the documentation. So as you can see, it takes in an array and an order. The orders can be either C, F, A, or K. It defaults to C, so that was the first example that we saw. And then F is based off of the columns. A means to read in the elements like Fortran. And K means to read in the elements in order they occur in memory. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this NumPy tutorial. For more NumPy tutorials, check out this playlist I have right here. I think you're gonna love it.